Welcome to the strangest secret of photography and life, YouTube video podcast number one. In this podcast, I'm going to tell you the story. I've been asked it many times. I have been a photographer for quite some time. It's been a hobby of mine for, for most of my life. But uh, for, a, for a period, I actually um, worked as a photographer. But I've been asked many times um, what got me started in photography, what, what happened that got me interested in it. So that's, um, that's what I'm going to tell you in this, um, in this YouTube video podcast number one. Right now, I'm 57 years old. I became interested in photography when I was nine years old. Now, I'll leave that up to you to work out when that was. It happened, I, I'm Hungarian by background, I live in Australia at the moment, I speak English. When I arrived in Australia as a nine-year-old kid, I didn't speak a word of English, didn't understand um, uh, the language, couldn't speak it, and um, uh, basically illiterate. I, um, our family left, um, left Europe, um, and went to Italy, and in Italy we got on a we got on a ship called the Achille Lauro, and we sailed out of out of Italy, out of Naples, and sailed through the Strait of Gibraltar down the west coast of Africa and stopped in Cape Town. And uh, in Cape Town we got off the boat, and um, and there was a market, and I, I I still vaguely remember it. It was quite a long time ago. At this market, there was um, there was someone was selling a camera. I didn't know what it was when I was nine years old, uh, but he was talking about this device that you can take a picture of something, or you you point it at something and you press a button and do whatever you do, and um, and um, and you uh, then you put it on a piece of paper and then you've got a picture of whatever it is that you you um, uh, you took a picture of. And, uh, and as a nine-year-old kid, I still remember thinking that that was, um, that was magic. I thought it was so amazing that it was magic. And I actually, um, I think I convinced my parents to, to buy it. I don't know how they bought it. We didn't have any money, so, um, or very little of it. Um, we're a big family of seven, and, um, and, and we, we were traveling halfway around the world. And um, anyway, we got, uh, we got back on the, on the ship back on the boat, the Achille Lauro, in, uh, in Cape Town, and uh, I put the film in, and as the ship, as the, the, the ship boat, whatever you call it, started to, uh, to leave the harbour at, uh, at Cape Town, there were some dolphins um, swimming and, um, in, in, the, in the wake of the ship, as they sometimes do, and so I, I, I got incredibly excited. Put the um, put the film in the camera, and um, and decided to have a have a go at taking the pictures. Well, I finished the roll, so I just kept snapping away and snapping away, as a um, you know like a like a nine year old kid with his first toy. And um, and so what I did was um, immediately when the roll was finished, I opened the back of the camera and took the film out to have a look at my pictures. And um, I I have to say that I do photography a little bit different these days. But uh, that's what it was back then. But I remember I was, um, I was incredibly disappointed that there was no pictures on the film. But of course, no one uh, bothered to tell me uh, as a nine-year-old kid that you had to develop the film and, uh, and go from there. But uh, that was the start of photography for me. And that's all until the next YouTube video podcast.